Hey there everybody. In this episode we're going to unbox and show the operating procedures for your new Aroma Breeze atomizing essential oil diffuser. All right, let's go ahead and unbox this Aroma Breeze. Here's the packaging. Uh, beautiful slip cover. Simply slide the interior box outside of the slip cover. Very easy to open. What you'll see in here are four different components to the content. First we have the base. The second we have the actual atomizer with a bottle attached. Of course this bottle is empty and clean so you can add your pure essential oil or a blend of a variety of oils that you have. This is the powerhouse for the Aroma Breeze. And then last but not least we have the air tubing and this comes in standard four foot length. And there's also a brochure in here that uh, tells you about the product. It demonstrates how to use it and safety instructions. Now I'm going to go ahead and assemble these components and demonstrate how this unit works. Okay, so here we have our four components and for demonstration purposes I've uh, opted for a shorter length of hose. And here I have a bottle that has hmm, eucalyptus oil. Okay, and then I'm going to simply attach my atomizer to my oil bottle. You'll notice there's no mixing. I don't have to touch the oil and uh, it's ready to go. So then I'll attach my hose to the atomizer I will slip my atomizer into the base then I don't have to worry about it staying up and simply connect it to the pump. Now I'm going to demonstrate the output of this atomizer by using a couple of high output LED lights because as some of our other products the atomizate or the, the vapor that comes out of this atomizer is very very fine. Uh, it's one to three micron molecule size, which allows the vapor to stay in the air of anywhere from three and a half to four hours. So it's very powerful and yet is very economical on the use of your oils. Let me demonstrate with the lights. All right, now I have gone ahead and positioned a couple of LED panels so that you can see the atomosate that's coming out of the atomizer diffuser more clearly. Because of the microscopic particles it's important that you just see how powerful this unit really is. So I'm going to begin by turning on the pump at its minimum output and you'll see right away that you get a, a fairly strong uh, amount of atomosate or some people might call it vapor. Uh, the beauty of this is on its lowest setting it would be very adequate almost up to a thousand square foot space in a fairly short period of time. I guesstimate after about 20 minutes you could turn it off or uh, go ahead and keep it running if you choose. Also you can connect a wall timer to this unit so if you choose to have it shut off and turn on at certain times of the day that makes it much more convenient. Now I'm going to demonstrate uh, how powerful this really can get by turning up the volume and when I say volume, I'm talking about the amount of atomosate or the output. So there it's about uh, half volume or half output. And you can see how much stronger that's gotten. And then I'll go ahead and I'll turn it to maximum output. Now I would say this is probably overkill. Uh, this is designed to uh, adequately diffuse a 1500 square foot room, you know, maybe even 2000 depending on the ambient air in any given room that you're using. 
Uh, but for my taste and for, uh, I think, best use of oil, I would probably go ahead and turn this down to about a quarter volume or a quarter output. Uh, and it will do a great job in a, in a good sized room. Again, this is designed so that you can control your output and not use too much oil if you feel that it's uh, a little excessive. Thank you for joining me for this episode of how to unbox and operate your new Aroma Breeze Atomizing Essential Oil Diffuser. Until next time, breathe life in.